Okay, I am going garage sailing today. Um, it is Saturday and I'm very excited because I love a good garage sale. Fingers crossed for a bookshelf or some planting pots. That one, I got this little um, makeup mirror for free, which is really, really lovely of him. So I got a little makeup mirror. Oh, wow. Okay, it is, okay, that's a lot of rain. Um, okay, so the last place I went to, they were just, they had just closed up when I got there and they um, they had had a bookshelf, but they just sold it. So I missed out on that one, but I think I can try again next week um, or next weekend, which we'll probably have more because it won't be a long weekend. Okay, so this is garage sailing part two. I think I filmed myself, that was a couple weekends ago and I don't actually know where the video went, so it's somewhere on my phone. Only like nine o'clock. I think, I think it's only nine o'clock here. Um, but the garage sailing here is like so intense. Everyone like, everyone's garage sales are from like eight to 12 on Saturday mornings. And then they like all shut down and are done for the rest of the weekend. Um, just so different from back home because back home people have them like all weekend and they like, I don't know, they open them at 12 or like 11 in the morning and then last until like four in the afternoon and people are drinking beer in their garages and it's just a lot different. I gotta go, I gotta go garage sailing. Oh my God, this is so much better than, um. oh my God. Oh, this is so much better than when I went last time. I, there's so many more garage sales. Okay, so I just went. Um, I went to two, three, two more before this last place and I got like some little bowls for free. Um, they were in their free bucket and I got these like ladles, those like, and they look like the Loch Ness Monster. And um, yeah, they're, I can't, I don't know where they're, but they're really cute. And I got those for three bucks. I got a bunch of little bowls for free at this last place I went to. They had this huge like warehouse and um, I got like an old sewing table. So one that like folds out. Um, and I got like a bookshelf and they said make me an offer and I offered them 40. I probably could have done less, but I mean, she said it was her mother's sewing table and then I was like, oh my gosh, okay. Um, anyway, it's really lovely. So I just got in, I would say a very nice deal. And I think that's good for furniture. I think like that is exactly what I want. I want like a little bookshelf and like a table of some sort. Um, so that's great. The only other thing was like plates and pots for my plants. So I might go, there's a couple more up at my house. Um, and I might go check those all out on my way home. I think besides that, I'm good. I think I'll be settled soon. Okay, the city I live in is not that big and somehow I've just like found a whole other section of it that I didn't even know existed. Okay, they just gave me a whole bunch of stuff for free. This last one I just went at, I, they just said like this entire table you can just take. So I got like a ton of little glasses, which I don't have. I don't have like short little glasses. Um, just for like water or whatever and a whole bunch of mason jars which is actually helpful because I had to leave my whole um, jar collection behind so it'd be nice to have some just like holds and things and oh those are cute dogs and um and then I got like a sheet which is like I don't know my mom would totally roll her eyes and be like why are you taking people's old sheets but it is completely it's like unopened and it's straight from the 90s and I thought it might make like a cool like tapestry wall hanging <laughs> um i don't know but yeah and then i got like a little those like little fish um like an ice cream tray of they look like fish um so yeah that was really fun um and really really kind of them okay i seriously misestimated how heavy that little sewing table was plus my bike's like in my doorway and i didn't really think about that so i just hefted it over and walked it in my back's gonna be really happy with me so okay so i got these little ladles they're like loch ness monster ladles these are the kind of things where you're like i hope this wasn't used as an ashtray this was the um sheet that i'm thinking of hanging up um yeah it's like brand new but it's obviously very like this is the back picture it's obviously from the 90s um which I kind of like. I think it's cute. Um, or I could use it on my bed, which I actually might do. Can't decide. I was kind of looking at it. I was like, ooh, can I make a dress out of this? Oh, 
Oh my god, look at them! They're so cute! <laughs> They're little Loch Ness monsters! This is what the bookshelf looks like. I like unpacked all my stuff. I finally got rid of the Tupperware containers that were sitting out. Um, so yeah, this is the bookshelf. Okay, and then this is the little table. I already have my sewing machine on it and all my sewing stuff. So yeah, all my furniture I think is settled now. I think that'll be good. I think I'm good for furniture now. Um, and yeah, I think I finally feel like here, I guess. Like, I think I finally feel like a little bit more settled than I did. Um, now I just need to clean because my place is a constant disaster. Um, but yeah, furniture's done.